Well, the main difference between the DS200 and the old Eagles is that there's actually ovals instead of being a right-in arrow, and instead of being to the right, it's to the left. So that'd be the, that's the main difference between the ballot. Otherwise, cosmetically, they look both the same. They're both the same size. Um, but yeah, the main difference is just the circles. Put two in there. And just like in past years, it has all the directions to the elector, too. So they know how to read it. Just read it over. It has all the directions. But like I said, you just fill it out to the left. And the difference between this is you don't have to use a pencil like you had to use the other one. Black ink, red ink, blue ink, you can use anything. Um, the only thing they don't say is Sharpies because it can actually leave a different mark and be a ballot error. But any ink is pretty much okay for these. And then what you do is you just slide it in here. The elector will just slide in on election day. And then it just scans it. And what it's actually doing... It accepted the ballot, but what it's doing when it takes a little delay is actually taking a photo image of the front and back of it, and every ballot is stored on the thumb drive. So after the election, if there was ever needed to be a recount or anything, if the state ever actually approved it, you could go back and look at all the ballots one by one. And you can also put the ballot in any way. You can put it upside down, sideways. It'll take it any direction. There's no specific way, like the Eagles, you had to set it in one way. You can put it upside down, sideways, reverse it. Overvotes are no longer allowed in the state of Wisconsin, so if you put too many votes for one party, it kicks it back to you, the ballot has to be destroyed, and the elector has to redo it. So that's really the main things. Otherwise, the machine, it's pretty, pretty simple. You got the screen, it's all interactive for the viewer, so they put it in, like I said, if they need to do anything to reject it or anything, they just hit the button. Otherwise, it's pretty self-explanatory.